I don't know why. That just got me so excited. Good morning, everybody. Uh, day three of our adventures in Universal uh, Magic Kingdom this morning. We're at Magic Kingdom, ready for uh, rope drop. And it looks like it's still here at the... <laughs> you can see the tree just over the over the entrance to the uh, train station there. Oh, this is so trippy, you guys. I am tripping out again. You thought I was tripping out. At Hollywood Studios, I am tripping out even more right now being here at the Magic Kingdom because this is some familiar right, stuff the other right here. Side's quicker. You can try to get in here, guys. When they make My it out, we're all going in. Hey, hey. We made it. They're still doing. They're still doing Christmas, and they're still Maybe doing the fiftieth. <laughs> Uh, this is pretty awesome, man. That's a huge train station. This is beautiful. This is lovely. What's like that? I wanted to do a, you know, a very sort of moody, atmospherical opening to this show, to the Magic Kingdom. But we're here for Magic Morning, and uh, we're trying to do the Mind Train ride. We cannot. It's not on regular Genie Plus. It's individual Lightning Lane, and uh, so we're trying to see if we can. Oh no. Oh. Not our shoe. <laughs> so we're gonna try to ninja uh, the mine train ride. So we gotta we gotta haul butt out over to Fantasyland, wherever that is. I have no idea where Fantasyland is. But let's see. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Wow! It's pretty cool. They have a nice train. Oh, okay. I cannot believe. You know it, it, what it is right now. The, the, I'm tripping up because. It's so sim similar and familiar, but it but more it does, yeah. yeah. Uh, so my my expectations were regular proper Disneyland, but I'm seeing all kinds of stuff that isn't regular proper Disneyland. <laughs> this is yeah. oh, this is amazing. How I'm already I'm already freaking out. I'm having a, a panic attack right now. Well, I, I, okay, it could be Christmas. Yeah, yeah, we'll get over that. We Once we get through Main Street, it won't be Christmas anymore. Oh my god, the castle. <laughs> Look at that. Oh my wow. gosh. Wow, okay. Yeah, that's impressive. I mean, I love her baby one at home, but that's really impressive. Wow, that's a big castle. <laughs> it's a wider Main Street also. Oop. I want to go in all these stores and eat all this food too. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you guys. Wow. Uh, we did it, kids. This is incredible. I cannot believe. <laughs> I cannot believe this is happening right now. Gosh. Wow, it is beautiful. I mean, I, uh, I love ours at home, but this is very nice. It's definitely Paris. More Paris vibes. This does it's, feel very Parisy, yeah. uh -huh. especially the wide open hub up yeah. there. Paris, although Paris has an elevated hub. I mean, their castle. Let's be real. Oh yeah, they, they forget have, it. <laughs> they don't have a dragon here at Walt Disney World. No, but I mean, that's what I'm saying. It's an awesome girl? castle. Uh, we're supposed to go to the right, I think, for early entry. Okay, do we show? I think we show a hotel key or something. Uh, sure. Uh, do, you, do you have one handy? Of course. Guys, look, Tomorrowland. Oh, they do. Oh, no. Oh, no. Look, there's the people mover. Oh, the Lilo and Stitch ride. I yeah. can see that. Oh, and there's the castle again. <laughs> Are you crying? Yeah. I'm just, I get to see new Disney. I'm also crying. Are you crying? I love it for you guys. Oh. I feel it. I feel it too here. It's just so new and different. I, I hope these guys are all going to Fantasyland. Huh? Everybody's going to Fantasyland, right? I think everyone's doing what we're doing, yes. Oh, they're wishing well. Oh, they're wishing well. <laughs> You'll have to walk over that way, though. Okay, sounds good. Thank you. Beautiful. Oh, yeah, it's got to be behind the castle, right? Fantasyland? Wow. Okay. I can't yeah, stop shooting. Sophie is in love with the castle. Dude, it's gorgeous. What is that right there? A restaurant called Starlight Cafe. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And we're off.
This feels familiar. So they're standby already for the mine train ride. My goodness. <laughs> I'm really enjoying this. By the way, we've lost Liz and Sophia. We're doing first time I've ever done parent swap. Uh, and so I, I left Liz at the entrance. She's going to wait for me at the lightning lane. And uh, I'm going to go to this queue. And you and I are going to enjoy this together. But I just love, I cannot, I cannot stop shooting and taking my eyes off of this queue. And we only just got started. I can't wait to see what's going on in here. I know they have some... Uh, interactive elements in here too. I remember seeing them when uh, Laramie went through here a hundred years ago. Oh, 
things go. Not on a turntable, they're just... That's great! Those are really good! That was really good! That's the most impressive part of the thing so far! Okay. By the way, the ride swap, the child swap, which was really handy. While I was waiting in the queue for Seven Boards Mine Train, which was delightful. The ride was great. The queue was great. I had more fun on that ride. I enjoyed that more than I thought I would. Probably because of the slower, dark ride portions. Uh, and then the, oh man, the animatronics for snow were great. Anyway, while I was doing that, while I was waiting in the queue, Liz took Sophia on the carousel right nearby. And now I can do this while she's, you know, in, in the queue for Seven Boards Mine Train. So even though we don't get to do that one together, we're getting things done, which is kind of kind of neat, kind of fun. Right here, Sophie. Come right here. Turning the to the right or to the left. The faster you turn it, the faster it spins. Seems our party is about to begin. Did you get a new Eeyore? Did mommy buy you an Eeyore? You love it? Are you going to spin? Yeah. When it goes, you spin really fast. Yeah. <laughs> Yay! Now spin it. There you go. We're going really slow. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, we're going faster now. We're going faster. We got Tomorrowland right next door. That's Autopia that is right next to the teacups. Ah! Oh! Did you break it? Did you get the high score? All done. Okay, let's go. Let's go find mommy. I don't know what this is, but this is delightful. <laughs> Enchanted Tales with Belle. Yeah, that's if that's a meet and greet, that is an elaborate meet and greet. Look the, at, oh, and that's the restaurant. Oh, that's, I think that, you're that, right. That's, that's Food and that's Bell's restaurant. Okay. Yeah. It's probably a meet and greet of Bell or something. Oh, this is lovely. It is gorgeous. Yeah. Okay, here's another castle reveal. Oh my God, that's just so big. <laughs> I can see why people are like, oh, dude, your castle is so tiny. <laughs> No, I know. I'm not. I'm not tripping, but I can see why people well, say that. Man. Yeah, but look at how roomy this is right here. Like, this is wild. It's kind of what's going on here with Fillmore Magic, which I heard I love is. Hot coffee wearing on like where I'm going. I don't. I don't either. I'm, I'm gonna ask a cast member where New Orleans Square is. See what they say. Can we go there? Do you think this place? I have no idea. Okay, this is really weird. A Peter Pan's flight, right? That's not the weird part. The, the facade, though, this is very much like it used to be at Disneyland back in the day, uh, you know, into the 60s and 70s. But right next door, it's, it's a small world. It's, 50, yeah, 55 for Peter Pan, there's small world. That is a wild, uh, I'm just not familiar with this at all. Where's the, where's the fancy small world facade? It's a five minute wait. 55 for Peter Pan, 5 for Small World. And I have no idea where we are. No idea. Oh, look, it's Peter. It's the Liberty Bell? I think, yes. 
So that's got to be the right direction we're going in then, if we're trying to find New Orleans Square, right? <laughs> I said it again. <laughs> uh, where, wherever Haunted Mansion is, we have a lightning lane for that. Oh, look at that. Wow, look at me. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I found it! Look at Liberty Bell. Yeah, oh, Liberty Bell, you're right. Liberty Bell, yeah. Liberty Bell, and. Oh, Long Mansion. Well, we're not ready yet. No, I know, so, uh, breakfast. Dude, Sleepy Hollow refreshments. I'm down. <laughs> we kind of just took a quick tour of Liberty's, Liberty Square. I love it. It's wonderful. It's delightful. We're going to show you some more right after we get a waffle or something. They got a fruit waffle. I'm going to try that. Should yeah. That? Okay. Let's get a fruit waffle. You want some coffee and get a water? Yeah, sure. Okay. Bum, bada, bum, bum, bum. They have chicken waffles too. Are you going to be okay with that? Yeah, it's Joffrey's. Whatever. That's fine. <laughs> I hate Joffrey's coffee, you, you guys. You want a cold brew? Uh, yeah, sure. Okay. Smells. Oh. Well, Disney World, you are killing me with your food, I must say. They're killing it with these They're costumes, too. They're killing it with Did the food. Did you see the costumes? Oh, yeah, and they look amazing in there. Absolutely amazing. <laughs> I love it. One fresh fruit waffle later. Ooh, there's Nutella in there. And lots of strawberries and a blueberry or two and some banana and a waffle. Oh, and it's wrapped in this fun uh, park ticket wrapper, old e-ticket type stuff. Oh, that's fun. Holy moly. <laughs> I got, oh my god. Is it fruit with Nutella and a waffle? I, just, I got strawberry Nutella and a waffle and I'm happy. <laughs> it's really basic, but it's perfect because I love Nutella. I like the yeah. sweetness of Nutella. So Strawberries are nice and tart. I didn't get any banana or blueberries. Yeah, soon. But, um,. I wish the new the waffle was a little bit more crispier. Oh, it's kind of doughy. Look doughy. doughy. I bet it has to be foldable. So. Chocolate in the waffle, no? already my favorite place. Yep. The old Christmas shop. Yeah, I remember saying to myself when I went to the club, like, this is my favorite land. Yeah. The it Hall of Presidents, like. It's all my haunted mansion. Yeah, it's very. Walt yeah, Walt City wanted Hall to build a Liberty Square. Walt wanted to build a Hall of Presidents, but he never got to it. So he got to it here. This yeah, is great. Yeah, I really like this. Yeah. There's a big giant, oh my God, they got a Liberty Bell. Okay. <laughs> the Liberty Bell. And then you could ride the Liberty Bell. Let's keep going this way. I wanna, I wanna go around the river a little bit. It's giving me definite New Orleans Square vibes right here. Yeah, a little bit. Because of the river, I mean. Is there like rivers in America, yeah. Yeah. When is their splash go down? Like the 25th or something like that? Uh, soon, like uh, yeah. like in a couple weeks. Yeah. I mean, if we have time, I mean, I'm down to parent swap and do that. Well, we've never, you know, I don't have any reference footage of it either, so uh, I would like to get some reference footage for, for later. Oh, they're the diamond horseshoe. Or the the gold diamond gold horseshoe. Gold. I wonder if the okay. ceiling is shaped like Bam. a diamond. Bam. Or is it a rhombus? Is it a diamond or a rhombus? They should call it the rhombus horseshoe. I mean, Diamond and Rhombus are very close together, according to Sophia. She knows <laughs> that's, a, that's a joke around our house because we watch shape shows all the time for Sophia. And she knows the difference. And she can tell the difference between a diamond and a rhombus. <laughs> and I'm like, no, you can't, you big liar. <laughs> oh, Country Bear Jamboree. They got a shooting arcade that nobody's enjoying at the moment.
This feels less frontiery than Desiland does. It's just, it's just so like spread out. Yeah. I, I mean, I prefer, yeah. You know, let's go for space. This is like, this is a lot of space. Like, a little bit more. That's their adventure land. What's... Oh. Is that their tiki room? Is that the tiki room over there? I think it is. Yes, it is. It is? Yeah. So you can you can cut through here into it. Yeah, let's go. I want to see what that looks like. Oh, here's Aladdin, the carpet ride. And there's the tiki room. Look at that. That's enormous. <laughs> My goodness. Yeah, what happened? We went from Frontierland to look kind of dead to a lot of action here at Adventureland. <clears throat> wow. Pirates like right around here. Look at that. And a squirrel. Oh! <laughs> what are you doing? I've been hit. <laughs> uh, Pirates is over right over there. Right over there. Okay. Yeah. Oh my God, that means the treehouse has got to be around here too. Okay, we got to come back to this. This is really cool. We were, or we are, going to be checking out Adventureland here in the near future. We got a lot of things to do here today, but we've got some uh, fast passes, some lightning lane for Haunted Mansion. As it turns out, so too does our friend Adam the Woo. You guys might know Adam the Woo. He's filming his show while we're here as well. He came to join us for the Haunted Mansion and maybe some other things, hopefully. We gotta, yeah, it's either, it's now or never. There he is. There's Adam the Woo right there. Are you there. in the Twilight Zone right now, David? I, yes, you yes. Like you're in the Twilight Zone? Well, I was literally on the Twilight Zone. We did Hollywood Studios, we did the Twilight oh Zone Tower. But you character. think a Twilight Zone here? I, I. The dark ride part. Yeah. So, they, I always say if they had to change one, the one they should have changed is the one in Anaheim. Because this one, I think, was superior. Don't be, don't be wrong, I love Disneyland, DCA version. But this has the dark ride. So if they're gonna keep one, I'm glad they kept this tower. Wait, what are we talking about? Tower Terror. Oh yes. No, when I got done with Tower yesterday, I was like, I, I love it. I, I miss it so much. I miss your breakout. Get out of here. Like I miss I miss Tower Terror a lot. Yeah. Anyway, uh, I'm glad you're here. I'm glad you're here. That, that you were able to spend a little bit of time yeah, with us today. Popped in. Yeah. Doing the lightning lane thing. Did you get a magic band? I have one, but I don't. Because your it. Disneyland magic band works here, right? Yeah, it should. Yeah. But I don't. That's a, when you're at Disney World, you gotta wear a magic. Band. I guess. I can't buy anything with it. Movies. I know. <laughs> so obviously this is a different facade than you are used to out on the West Coast, David. This is not New Orleans Square. No. I love the, it, like Tower Terror also, how it's, you know, elevated. Yeah. Uh, that's really neat. I really like Our that. Our stretch room doesn't move. Spoiler alert. Right. It, the last one. We didn't, we didn't get to see some of the other interactive stuff, huh? This haunted room actually stretching, or is it? Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> are we gonna? So does the doom buggy go past the portraits, or where are the portraits? So our portrait room is on the right. It's on the right. Okay. Where Anaheim? Yeah. Walk through it. Yeah. Oh, this is okay. So this is the portrait part, isn't it? Oh yes, and no flash pictures, please. Very last one, just get ready for a photo. Look at the last portrait okay. right here. Oh, the camera down a little bit. Wherever you dwell, give 
give us a hint by ringing a bell. You didn't like it. No, I loved it. Oh, you did? No, oh. I, loved it. I don't remember the beginning at all. Like I it was a whole different like entry way. Yeah, yeah, you uh the the the, the, the portion hall and all that. I, I kind of liked it a lot. I was like, can we have this also in our on a mansion? I love yeah. the stairways with the like walking footsteps. See, I I can't I I didn't have fancy cam ready. So I had to, uh, I, I, you, I could not see any of that through the lens. Oh, it was, yeah. it's pretty. And then when it became like OG Haunted Mansion at home, I was like, okay, I love it. it a looks, lot of it is the same. It's exactly the same. It's just really dark. So like yeah. ours has been Well, that's what I was going to say the same thing. Yeah. It's, I thought Haunted Mansion at home was dark, but this is way darker. Is it darker here? Yeah. It's dark here. Oh, it's yeah. so dark. But you know, yeah. I like that too. I loved it. I mean, I'm not crazy about their uh, exterior of the house. Well, you do feel more connected to it when you go when you go to Disneyland. You're, you're like the the mansion's in your yeah. It's and in just, your just like style wise. I'm yeah. not huge on the red. Oh place, yeah. Like something spooky, but inside's amazing. Yeah. What you think of the staircase scene? I love spooky eyes. I didn't get that at first. That's the wallpaper. Those are the eyes from the wallpaper. Yeah. I love that. I loved all of that. So yeah. I, it's definitely pros and cons, but I do love this haunted mansion. I love I love Magic Kingdom and Walt Disney World. Can I keep saying that? <laughs> do you now? Oh, I do. Yeah, I do. <laughs> Guys, look at the size of the little river that they have that uh, creates the moat for the castle, Cinderella Castle, compared to the Disneyland moat. Look at that. Look at that, that's enormous. Oh, oh, fireworks are happening. There's a show going on. Oh, it's already over, it's done. We missed it. We missed the magic. Oh my. Things got crowded here when we were, since we left. We invite Main Street. you to enjoy the rest of your magical friendship. Look at they got a whole stage up there and everything. Magic Kingdom. Can't stop without checking out the partner statue, right? Thanks, Walt. And Roy, actually. How lucky are you guys? Oh my god, how lucky are you? They've got Carousel of Progress and a People Mover. We've got a giant empty launch bay building that's going to be converted to DVC Lounge. Which I'm excited about because it's DVC, so I get to go up there. Yeah, it looks at you. Hey, invite me in when you get here. <laughs> when I get there, we're up there, hanging out. Good heavens! The space! Yeah! Guys, I'm about to go on the people mover. <laughs> I'm about to go on the people mover! <laughs> I have waited a lifetime for this. And there's the Carousel of Progress building, which we're hopefully going to do next if we have time. I've got to take a break in the middle of the day to do a, another hotel tour, and we're going to go to the Wilderness Lodge, but if we don't get to it before, then we'll come back and do Carousel of Progress and the monorail, hopefully. But this is just spectacular. I love it. This is the motion that you always wished you could have at, uh, at Disneyland. Look, they got the Astral Orbit up there on the top. Oh, that's so cool. And then you got, I saw people over go by a second ago. Uh, there it goes over there. And I, 
Like, this is just a life, a, a, a Disney lifetime of wishing and dreaming that we can have this. I sure hope I don't get let down. Like, that's always, you know, huh? Like, you know, there's that fear, like, you know, they say don't meet your heroes or, you know, nostalgia is sometimes better. I'm right? I'm about to meet my hero. Go get mommy. And other appendages inside your car. And please supervise younger beings. Stay clear of the doors, which will open and close on the back. Enjoy your journey. Stay clear of the doors, which will open and close on the back. Enjoy your journey. Wow, pretty cool, huh, baby? Para su seguridad, permanezca sentado y mantenga sus manos, brazos, pies y piernas dentro del vehículo. Oh, you look so cute right now. I can't. Oh my god. You're in deep breath. Stop it. I'm going to cry too soon. Oh, it goes fast. This is the TTA Blue Line. Non stop service around tomorrow. Oh my god. I mean, I'm not saying it's a roller coaster. Well, there's Tron. Oh, there's Greetings, cool, intergalactic huh? travelers. Welcome aboard the People Moon. Is... I'm Morak 5, oh gosh, your guide you. aboard this highway in the sky. The absolute best way to see it's it tomorrow. Disney, so bad. In my stars, is there ever lots to see? From oh spacecraft to monster. Great. There's really nothing like it. Oh my god, stop it! Oh. For your safety, you chocolate. if you have wings, jetpacks, or gravity polarizers, please do not take flight while on board. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, they just need to bring one of these over to Anaheim. I don't get why they can't. Why can't they? I don't understand. Yeah. Huh? Because they can't make up their mind. They can't make up their mind? They could do it if they want. It's not even that expensive. So what's one their problem? Oh, here we go. This is the reason oh. why you get in the people. Over. First off, progress. Walt Disney's amazing dream for a We're probably going to go through the gift shop, I think. Oh, I can move right there. Look at it. Oh, actually, yeah, top right here, look. Look, there's even a tiny people oh. over. I wonder if that means there's a tiny over. Wow. Yes, that's Progress City right there. Yeah. Epcot. That's why you go. That's why I ride right there. Oh! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! That was such a cute video. I have to get Oh my god! Look at this baby! Look at the cars! It's so cool! Guys, we're going right over the top! Well, technically, it's Tomorrowland Speedway, but I don't. Hey, they're testing! They're testing! I guess they, they test pretty much all day around, but... Oh, they're strong. You should get another one in a second. It's like every 20 seconds. Oh, they're working. Look. Yeah, that's oh. a train tractor. Train tractor right here. You know him. Train tractor right down here. Yeah, that's new, right? Right here's the train. She likes you. Okay, we can Good job. When it opened, correct? Uh, I don't know if it was here when they opened, but it's been around for a while. Thank you, Mr. Morrow. Mr. Tom Morrow, please contact I mean, it's pretty old, though. You can tell, which I really appreciate. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
<laughs> wow. Okay. I got January 30th. Oh, you got the 29th. Oh, can we see it? Can you see anything? And so does the carousel. Like progress itself, this theater never stops. Inspire a new generation to dream of a great big, beautiful tomorrow. Yeah, great big, beautiful tomorrow. Oh, I love that. Oh, maybe. I thought they played it. God, I love the tomorrow lab. They changed the wheel like a couple months ago. That was so much fun. I'm glad we did that. Sophie, you want to go on Choose Your Train? Yeah? Okay. No? You don't want to go on Choose Your Train? You're such a liar. Yes, you do. Uh-oh, they hurt you. They're not happy. Space Rangers, report to your Star Cruiser to join this daring space mission. Okay, see you on Earth. Affirmative. We're on it, Buzz. You can count on us. I would totally do this yeah. all day, every day. Yeah. Alright, Disney, if you're listening, bring it back. Oh, come on. I haven't, the, I haven't shut up about the people for, for almost <laughs> 10 years on our channel, and they haven't done anything, so... Okay, well now, now that's a 10th year, they're like, I don't okay, think they're interested in satisfying Fresh Bakes' need for a people mover no, <laughs> at Disneyland. I'll put it in the atmosphere, I'll manifest it, we'll get one. Okay, you could do that. Just put that put in. Put olives on the pizza. <laughs> you know, and it's not even just the paper movers that I love. I mean, I love, I love that. I wish we could have, I wish we had a second camera. We should have done that. But uh, I was in moments of, of just being speechless. I was not let down at all. I was afraid that I wouldn't enjoy it. I was afraid that it would be just one of those nostalgic things where uh, you know it's only great in your memory. But this is not the case. The People Mover is it is a, a just amazing attraction. It is, it is my perfect my perfect attraction. But I'm really enjoying just being here in Tomorrowland too. I love the energy here in this Tomorrowland. There's so much happening, so much going on. Just a lot of positivity and the music and all the attractions happening and everything that's everything that I love about Tomorrowland is here. Everything I love about Vintage Disneyland is here. Storybook Circus. We're here not to ride Dumbo A or Dumbo B. We may be doing Barnstormers later because that's a ride that uh, Sophia can do. They don't have Casey Jr., do they? Or is that just a prop? No, but we are here to ride a train. We're gonna pick up the uh, Disneyland Railroad, which was closed for four years while they were building Tron. So somewhere back here, oh, there it is. There's the Disneyland Station, or the Fantasyland Station for the Disneyland Railroad, or the, Dis <laughs> the Disney World Railroad. Guys, I'm still at Disneyland. Sophia found <laughs> a little splash zone. Here at what story? Where are we? Storybook Circus. Oh my God, she's wet. 
<laughs> Is that refreshing? Yes, look at that, Carrollwood Park. The Fantasyland Station is Carrollwood Park. <laughs> you know, those are the things I enjoy. I enjoy that kind of stuff. Oh look, perfect timing. Oh, could it be? We're gonna be on the Walter Elias Disney. No way. Not the Roy or the Lily Bell. David, you're going on wall. I yes, I am. I love trains. <laughs> We'll head for Frontierland after that. Stay seated and keep your hands and arms, feet and legs inside the train at all times. Oh, and please keep an eye on your children. As you know, I love this railroad about as much as a songbird loves the morning. But I'm still awed by the rockets in Spaceport 75. The technology <laughs> limit. Unidentified users detected in upload conduit area. Scanning. Calculating. Locomotive maintaining trajectory. Intervention not required. And that's the secret that makes intergalactic travel possible. <laughs> so simple, <laughs> what's your Yes, that's there is in this place of boundless optimism, the possibilities are endless. You might say the sky's the limit, but even that is no obstacle in tomorrow. Land. Carefully disembark. If you have strollers to unfold, please take them all the way beyond the planet so new passengers can safely While I'm trying to figure that out, it'd be mighty kind of And while we're being neighborly, what say we give our fellow traveler friendly wave hello? This is Main Street Station, after all. Welcome to Main Street, USA. We're currently departing Main Street Station. And if you're missing those friendly faces already, not to worry. On this train, it's never goodbye. It's always see you real soon. But I can't really see anything on this train. And wouldn't you know it? With a bit of gumption and a dash of magic, here I am. So believe it when I say that around here, anything is possible. You know what they do have though, it's such amazing. Uh, see what I mean? Hope you packed the compass because that, folks, is the sound of adventure. This is great, the, uh, the, the commentary. Land, I should say. Way better than that. Whether navigating wild jungle rivers, swashbuckling with jolly buccaneers, or even just scaling a towering treehouse, there's always plenty to explore here in Adventureland. If you're more of the rootin' tootin' type, then partner, saddle up, cause this here's Frontierland. Only the cowpokes, campfires, and country bears, this outpost is full of tall tails and even taller mountains. Yonder is Big Thunder Mountain and its runaway mine trains, while just ahead is Splash Mountain, where you'll find Br'er Rabbit in his laughing place. Those of you who've been riding with me for a spell already know how much I love minding this railroad. But for those times I'm fixing for something a bit wilder, Big Thunder Mountain is the place. Because there, the trains have a mind of their own. Well, finally, something to look at. Right now, Big Thunder Mountain is closed. <laughs> The 
change in scenery means we've left the rattle and rumble of that old gold mine behind and entered my favorite leg of the journey. Lush wilderness, calm waters, and untamed beauty. This is the place to soar with Dumbo or join Goofy in his stunt plane for some airborne acrobatics. This station is also your gateway to the rest of Fantasyland and Tomorrowland. Now, please wait until the train has come to a complete stop. Gather your juggling pins, unicycles, and other belongings. <laughs> I love this guy. And carry your strollers away from the platform before unfolding them. That way, we can start loading up for the next leg of our trip. Time to take a break. We gotta do a little business. We're gonna go to a hotel yeah, tour. Got to go to the Wilderness Lodge. Is that yeah, where we're headed? Yeah, so we're going to the Wilderness Lodge. They said we're going to little tiny boats, but I think it's those right there. Yeah, one of these boats right here. Yeah. Now, if we were home, that would be the Esplanade, and the other side would be DCA. But <laughs> this is really trippy, actually, having this view because it feels so familiar. We can turn around and you see the main entrance. But on golly, this is kind of wonderful. You know, I kind of had a feeling before we went on this trip that one of the things that I was going to enjoy most about coming to Walt Disney World wasn't exactly the, the parks, which have been great, but I really, really wanted to see how this whole resort sort of connected to each other. And I had asked a question, I don't remember if I asked it in the video or, or to myself, why they didn't run the Skyliner to more of the resorts. But as we go through these resorts here today, I, I realized it's possible, I don't know this for sure, but one of the reasons why that might be is because some of these, you know, some of the resorts are serviced by the monorail, as we just did. Some are serviced by the ferries that go between. And so they don't need, you know, a skyliner to go to. It's just really cool the different ways that all these resorts are connected and how it's just impossible to believe that these are all in the same, the same property and they're all servicing the same, you know, parks, etc. I love the, just the, the immensity of this whole universe that they have created out here in Walt Disney World in the way that there's monorail right there. Uh, that monorail, that's the express, I think. So I think that was just going straight to, I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> they have just really got it figured out here. So impressed, loving all of this. We're going back in the park. Yes, we are back in the Magic Kingdom. Took a quick break, well not a quick break, <laughs> an hours long break to go look at some uh, of the hotels, you know, some of the resorts around the area. Part of our getaway today group, uh, we went and looked at, today we looked at the Polynesian, the, the Grand Floridian, the Contemporary, and the Wilderness Lodge via uh, an array of monorails and ferries it's been so fun just checking that out, but we're back in Disneyland for a minute. We're going to go uh, catch Carousel of Progress, I hope, and maybe another ride on uh, People Mover if we, have, if we have the time, because after that, we're getting back, we're getting back on the monorail, going back to the Grand Floridian, because apparently something that I referenced in the, Grand, in the Florida, uh, or in the video about the Grand Floridian, we're going to get to watch the fireworks from, I think it's the California, oh, I forgot what it's called. Anyway, from the roof, from the roof of the Grand Floridian, we're going to watch the fireworks at this time. It's going to be art. I've been doing this all day at the Magic Kingdom. But for now, let's go to Carousel of Progress. <laughs> It's familiar, but different. I feel like I'm at Disneyland, but I'm not. I don't feel that at all. I do. I'm trying to 
trying to familiarize myself that I'm at home. But I actually don't mind it being separate, you know what I mean? No, I, again, I enjoy, I'm enjoy, it's the differences that I am enjoying, but it still does feel familiar. Liz and I were just having a debate about whether or not we're trying to compare Disney, you know, Magic Kingdom to Disneyland, which is what you're going to do. Like, you know, natural. we live at Disneyland, right. it's natural. Yeah. But I was telling you that I, I feel, I feel Walt here. I feel Walt on, I felt Walt on Main Street. Yes. I, I, feel, I, feel, Walt I felt Walt at Liberty Square. Definitely at Liberty Square. But I also feel here in Tomorrowland. And you weren't feeling that as much? I, I don't feel Walt anywhere in, in Tomorrowland. Honestly. Really? Yeah. I don't this know, whole thing I don't know is a lot screaming about, Walt to me. You see, you know more of like, you know, what he did. And maybe I need more knowledge on that. I, I just feel like every Tomorrowland's Where are we going? That's it might change my mind now knowing that's what he did. But Tomorrowland to me just feels feel so themely like out of place with everything else. You, but it, it's as Carousel of Progress is as Walt as anything you will ever find at Probably any Probably when Disney I get park. on the ride, I'm gonna be like, oh yeah, I can't. Have you ever seen a video of it or anything? I have seen like that clips of it, yes I have. Right. You know, Walt loved the idea of progress and he loved the American family. And he himself was probably as American as anyone could possibly be. Beautiful tomorrow, just a dream away. Yeah, it looks like the Robins are getting ready to celebrate Valentine's Day today. <laughs> what year is it? Oh, right around the turn of the century. And believe me, things couldn't be any better than they are today. Yes, sir, buildings are towering now as high as 20 stories. The moving pictures flicker up on a big screen. We have almost 8,000 automobiles in this country, and we can travel by train from New York to California in less than seven days. Yes, sir, we've got everything we need to make life easier. Say, Mother, mm -hmm. I was reading about a fellow named Tom Edison who's working on an idea for snap-on electric lights. Electric lights? No more kerosene, no more gas. <laughs> Sarah sure gets the core of the apple. But we do have this new wash day marvel. Now it takes me only five hours to do the wash. Imagine, <laughs> it used to take two days. Well, we have one of those new talking machines. Now that is something. It plays music right here in our home. There's a great, big, beautiful tomorrow. Ah! She keeps that thing going all day long. Ah! Progress. Ah! <laughs> Considering all the conveniences we now have, I'll say that we're really on easy street these days. It just can't get any better. Just goes to show that there's a great big beautiful tomorrow Shining at the end of every day There's a great big beautiful tomorrow And tomorrow's just a dream away Man has a dream and that's the start He follows his dream with mind and heart And when it becomes a reality It's a dream come true And you would be so there's a great big beautiful tomorrow Shining at the end of every day There's a great big beautiful tomorrow Just a dream away Well, it's another Halloween here in the fabulous 40s Everything is better than ever now, and we've got some amazing new wonders around the house to prove it. For instance, our refrigerator holds more food and ice cubes, and thanks to our automatic dishwasher, oh, I don't have to dry the dishes anymore after supper. Gives Rover and me more time to enjoy our evening stroll together. Man has a dream, and that's the start. He follows his dream with mind and heart. And when it becomes a reality, it's a dream come true for you and me. So there's a great big beautiful tomorrow. Now it's a little tricky. Just use your game glove to fly behind the other guy and blast him with your laser blaster. Laser blaster? Well, I'll give it a try. Take a look around, Grandma. You're in the ship. Feels like I'm really there. Hey everybody, I'm done programming our new voice activation system. Now all our household items will do anything we tell them to do. Great. Tell our refrigerator to bring me a root beer. Temperature to 375. Temperature increase to 375. Look at that. It even talks fast. You know in my day Oh they... no. You're not going to tell us about the old days when you didn't even have a car phone. 
<laughs> hey, Trish, for a while we didn't even have a house phone, not to mention laser discs and high def TV. Take that, you nincompoop! Hey, check it out, Dad. Grandma's up to 975 points. What? Wow. Yeah, Carousel of Progress. It was awesome. Did you like it? Yeah, I liked it. I, I love anything just like old school and like yeah. historical. Uh, I thought it was, it was theatrically like my stage managing and like stage crew and like the set, obviously like the props, the costumes. And it's so vintage. I mean, that, now I don't know. Do you remember Innoventions when they had, when they did a show like that? Kind of. I wasn't. I think I was way too young for that. The, Interventions before it became the, before it really started to deteriorate. That final scene when they're in the kitchen, they pretty much recreated. That's where we saw Osimo. They had a robot called Osimo. You can see Osimo now on Autopia. That same robot that's on Autopia oh, okay, okay. used to be in the Interventions building, and there was a scene about him training the Osimo robot. The exact same set. It was a dad with a kid on a stool like that. And yes, by the way, we are getting on the people mover again. Just coming up the ramp right now. So happy. <laughs> Definitely doing this two times before we go home. This is the TTA Blue Line. Oh, no. Don't stop service around tomorrow. Do you like this ride? See that right there, that's how Tomorrowland should be. People mover loading in the middle. Uh, Astro Orbiter up top and then the launching the lunching pad food service on the bottom. Like it. is Walt Disney's Carousel of Progress. As usual, we'll keep moving ahead. I've said this a lot this week so far, and I'm probably going to say it some more, but I was not expecting to love Tomorrowland as much as I have. I really, really enjoyed Tomorrowland. It's what Tomorrowland should be. It's closer to the Tomorrowland that I prefer at Disneyland, you know, what that era of, of Disneyland in the 70s or so. They kind of, they've kept it. A lot of Magic Kingdom, uh, they've kept in the same spirit, Fantasyland. They kept it like it was, you know, back in the uh, 70s and the 80s. Now, having said that, I really like Fantasyland today at Disneyland. Um, I prefer that to the Fantasyland that's here. 
just in terms of the aesthetic. But it's cool that that Magic Kingdom hasn't. It still stays in the same roots. Not always to the great effect, but it's cool that they are at least doing that. That they're trying. My only regret today is that we didn't get to do enough, or enough of what I was hoping to do. We're heading back over to the Grand Floridian right now because we're going to go watch the uh, fireworks. And I'm, I don't think I'll have the stamina to come back to the park again. I'm already whipped. <laughs> so I think this might be, the, the, the fireworks show that we're going to go see might be the end of our night. I would have liked to have seen uh, uh, some other, you know, like um, Splash Mountain. I would have liked to have seen some, you know, gotten some reference footage of Splash Mountain. Would have liked to see more of Fantasyland taking Sophia on the Barnstormer and stuff like that. Would have liked to have ridden the Liberty Bell. Maybe, you know, oh God, we didn't eat the tree house. We didn't get to do the tree house. You know, it's just, a, it's a reason to come back. <laughs> it's a reason to come back to Walt Disney World because we only did about a third of Hollywood Studios. Uh, and we're probably only going to be able to do about a third or a half of Epcot tomorrow. But, uh, hey, hi guys. I, uh, but the, no matter what, this has been some of the most highly concentrated fun that I have ever had in my life. And I am so grateful that, um, that this place exists and that we have an affiliate relationship with Getaway Today. Here's one of their guys right here. <laughs> I just passed him. Uh, that we have the relationship with Getaway Today that has made this possible. So as I am inclined to remind everybody, if you are planning a trip to Disneyland, to Disney World, to Universal, uh, or any trip at all, contact Getaway Today. There's a link in our in the description. It's an affiliate link. So that when you book, you book through them. They know that we sent you. And uh, they are... I have you know, spent a lot of time with the core group of the Getaway Today. It's a family business. Nicest people. They are so kind. And I'm not just saying that because they you know, sent us on a trip. They have been super kind. They are the nicest people I've ever met. I love them all so much. Uh, so, yeah. Um, if, you're, if you're looking to book a trip, use Getaway Today. Um, but, yeah. I don't think I'm going to sign off quite yet, but I wanted to get all that out here while I was talking on my way out of Main Street. Again, I'm enjoying this very much. The vibe here is so great. Uh, stay tuned. Fireworks coming up next. Waiting for our monorail. And I think I misspoke before. I thought that we were going to see the fireworks from the building next to Contemporary, but it's from the Floridian. There's a boat that's going to... You're going to be able to watch the fireworks from a boat. Right off that dock right there in the center of your frame. There's our monorail. We welcome you aboard our highway in the sky and hope you enjoy the magic kingdom. We are traveling to Disney's Contemporary Resort. During our travels, please hold on to the handrail and stay clear of the door. For the comfort of others, I am in love. Thank you. Infatuated with this whole thing, the monorail. Monorail. Okay. It's amazing. The whole transportation system is going on with this. It's so... <laughs> I don't know. I can't describe it. I am at a loss for words. It's, it's so real and necessary. Magic. Look at it. If I included this, or if I'm going to include an earlier trip through the contemporary in this vlog, it might be part of a different video. But here we go. Anyway, taking this monorail through the contemporary has been on my bucket list for 10 years. The door's open. If you're exiting, please gather your belongings, walk your head and step, and really resort. Stop. 
This is, I'm glad I brought my jacket because it was once again chilly this morning, not as bad as it was yesterday. Wow. Oh, is Chris bringing the, the treats? Bringing some treats, I guys. Oh my god, pretzels. is that? Is this a regular one? Oh, you're yes. mine. I'll share those pretzels with you. Okay, Do you want good. the espresso brownie? You want a brownie? Do you oh, want the, I don't know the rolled could... gold? Oh, you want some chips? Some chips? You know what? Give me that espresso brownie. Yeah, all right, all right, all right, all right. Triple chocolate. Oh, espresso, there you go. that it all started with a dream. But you want to know what makes this place really special? It's you, because you are the magic. Make a wish upon a star. Close your eyes and just believe it. against you. The journey may leave a scar. We have found what we seek. The magic of dreams come true, in fact, lies within you. This magical kingdom remains a beacon to those with a wish in their heart, gifting every person who walks through these gates this enchantment. Look inside yourself and realize that you have everything you need to make all 
your dreams come true. Anything is possible, for you are the magic. Just believe in the Grand Floridian Bay behind us, way off in the distance, that, that vaguely pink, purplish thing is Cinderella's Castle, and we just got done watching the fireworks out there in that bay. Uh, we were out there for like a good hour and a half, by the way, you, which we didn't even show you. They take the tour all over the water, all over the lake, showing you all kinds of different sights. That was really amazing, really fun, great way to see the fireworks show. Great way to end this show here from the Magic Kingdom. What a spectacular day we had tonight. Oh my god. I just I just wish we could have done more. I wish we could have had another day here. But it's they're yelling at us. But it's tomorrow is Epcot. I hope you guys enjoy. It. Follow us on Instagram at underscore fresh bake on Twitter at Fresh Bake Disney. That's fresh with no E and on TikTok at Fresh Bake Disney. And if you like our show and want to show you support, please do consider joining our Patreon campaign. And please do consider using Getaway Today for all of your travel needs to Disneyland, Disney World. They're, they're awesome, awesome people who really take good care of you and really know what they're talking about. They're a great group. group. So uh, use the link below. Uh, and then be safe out there. Be kind to one another. Fresh break.